Hi guys, listen. <clears throat> I got a message a couple of weeks ago from uh, .gov, HRMC, whatever it's called. Uh, and they saying, I'm due some tax back. And I thought, oh, am I due from tax back? I don't even work. Do you know what I mean? You don't get tax back when you're on benefits. Anyway, I thought, I wonder, I wonder if I, I paid... I paid extra tax on my benefits so I start filling it all in and the more I'm filling in the more sus I'm getting and then I knew it was sus as soon as well the what had been bank details so I started to put I put my bank details in but they wanted the three digit pin number on the back secret number what nobody has unless you're paying for something you don't give that number out unless you're paying for something. Do you know what I mean? Right? And they asked for my three-digit number on back. And I knew straight away I thought, this is sus as fuck. Do you know what I mean? This is sus. Why are they wanting my three-digit number off back of my card to give me some tax back? What I shouldn't even be due for any anyway. Anyway, I scrapped it. But I went on my bank today. And it's saying there's a scam. There's a scam going about and they're asking for for money off you. Uh, and the, it's it's from the same place, dot God, but it's fake. So if you say I'm on Santa Day, if you've got online banking, log on to it and this message will come up and it'll tell you about it. So if you're saying that you're due for any tax back, if it's saying you're due for any tax back, obviously you don't get that from them. You get tax back from somewhere else. Uh, so it's fake. So whatever you do, anybody out there who, who, who might just not think, you might think, oh, I'll give them it. You know, never give your bank details. Never, You know, unless you're buying some, like from a company or not like that, or you trust, but never give your bank details out, especially the three-digit number on the back. You don't give that to anybody. That's the only way they can get money out of your bank. If they've got that, you've had it. Do you know what I mean? I don't know if they can get money any other way, but um, the, the Santander are really strict, so if somebody tries to get in my account and they give me money, what have I got? You know... To be able to do it, but <clears throat> we may not be rich. But some people could fall for that. So I just thought I'd give you a warning. There is a dodge, some dodgy going off with, uh, you know, some there's some fraudulent going off somewhere. I can't quite pinpoint it at, but it's something to do with dot gov uh, or M I H C. What is what that tax place, whatever it's called? Nah, I mean me getting tax back. Filled it, filling it all in, and then it wanted my three digit number. Uh, duh, uh like no. As if I'm going to give you that. Oh, my God. Why do you want that? That is to pay money out, not to put money in. People don't ask for your three-digit PIN number to put some money in your bank, do they? So just beware. I just thought I'd give you a warning about that. Just in case there's any older people out there who don't understand, who think that they have got to put their details in and they don't understand, please don't just go on. If you get an old dodger like that, because like banks or old like that, they... They wait, ask for your bank details or all like that because they know your bank bank details or like the job centre and social and like other people know your bank details obviously for your wages to go in. But I just want to warn you guys, just really be careful because there's some, there's some scams going about. So if ever you want, if they want your bank details, it's a no no unless you are buying some of somebody you know what you're doing. If you randomly get a call or a message, an email saying that you owe them money, do not pay any money out, uh, it'll be a fake scam. Get in touch with the whoever it is who's trying to ring you or the real the real firm company, do you know what I mean? Like uh, .gov. Uh so that was, I just thought I'd best give you a warning about that, guys. Just in case, never give your bank details out, especially the three-digit PIN number if somebody says you owe them some money. So, mm-mm, big fat no. Alarm. Just get them alarm bells ringing. You know what I mean? 